hello guys please welcome to my channel once again in today's video i am going to be showing you how to use your facebook page or how to use your facebook business page if today has been your first time on this particular channel please kindly subscribe for more lessons like this in the coming days and if you are looking for a video on how you can be able to create your facebook page i've made a video on that links will be in description for you to go check that out before popping back onto this particular video that talks about how you can be able to use your facebook page alongside your facebook account let's dive into this very quickly all right so once you've gone onto your facebook account like i said you've got your facebook page created already how you can access that is tap onto the menu option showing right here and these are a couple of pages that i have got if you've created a facebook page this is how it will be separated from your account so right here if you need to operate with your facebook page you need to tap onto the facebook page this way and right here this is how it pops out if you've tapped onto your facebook page you've got an overview this is how your page looks like and these are all the setup that you have done onto your page recently all will be seen uh, at the bottom of this particular list called overview so you need to move on to the ads if you've got an ads running this is how you can be able to get access to that if you want this is the no notification column and right here you can be able to see and respond to all the notifications that are coming onto your facebook post that you have made with your facebook page you've got a feed of stuff that you've posted and stuff that people have posted or people that you have liked and they are also making posts available you can respond to that or all the things that are available on your facebook page now moving on you've got the cover photo showing up right here you can edit that by tapping onto the edit sign showing up and that will send you straight into your gallery where you can be able to edit or upload a new cover photo if you want right here this is your profile picture and you've got to publish right here you can be able to publish anything by tapping on that you'll be able to paste links that you have copied of your stuffs that you want to post or videos that you want to post here you can be able to post photos or make posts using a photo of your product you can be able to promote your page if you want and right here also you can be able to view your facebook page and this is how people are going to see your facebook page if they tap on it so you can write your tap onto your facebook page to see how it looks the services that you render with this particular page need to be put in right here at the service column and these are events that you have participated in if you tap on it you are going to be met with past events and upcoming events that you can create yourself for your audience to uh, have a look moving on these are your posts that you've made your photos are available right here you can create a post like i've said your photos can be used to create a post you can create a story and reels if you want so right here you need to tap on settings and see how that works very quickly you've got general this is generally all the things that you have made available onto your facebook settings and features you've got the page info this is the information that you have let go uh, available on your facebook page you've got the messaging you can respond and send message using this particular feed right here notifications that i've talked about and moving on straight onto your instagram and whatsapp account right here you can be able to link these both social media accounts to your facebook page so that you can transact all your businesses with this account using the facebook page as a link to them linking these two pages or accounts together won't be that difficult all you need to do is to tap on it and right here you can be able to connect both accounts by tapping onto the connect session and that will require a few more login details for you to pull that through tapping onto the whatsapp you'll be able to have your whatsapp account linked onto your facebook page for you to transact your businesses and all that very perfectly now i'm moving on to a particular story that a lot of people have been asking me is how you can be able to comment with your facebook page rather what you need to do is to move on to the page that you want to comment on and one secret that i want everyone to know is reasons why you cannot be able to comment with your page on people's posts is because they've made those posts known to all your friends and your page however is not part of their friend list so because of that you cannot be able to comment with your facebook page on people's posts 
but however posts that are made public or posts that comes from pages uh, that are made public you can use your facebook page to comment on those particular posts right here you can see a page and what you need to do is to tap on the profile icon showing up right here there you go so these are all the accounts that you have got or other page that you have got you can comment using your facebook page by tapping onto the page this way automatically your account has been set to comment with the facebook page of yours you can go ahead and comment and this is how you'll be able to differentiate between your facebook account and your facebook page if this particular video has been helpful or if there's something i've not been able to touch right here please you can leave that in the comment section and i'll be able to address that properly enjoy the rest of the day and please subscribe to my channel for more lessons like this in the coming days i'll be seeing you again in another exciting piece of content please have a great day